Okay, all you little Telga Harris is cult members of his Juiced Bikes Club. It's not a cult, dude. This is your shock absorber that is in one side of your fork. This is the same thing you've got holding up the hood of your car or the trunk of your SUV. Look at this. One finger. That's your shock absorber. I'm not making this up. And then this is your rebound spring. And look at the pl look at what you got on it. One inch, inch and a quarter of, of spring. Okay, now, realize that I am a layman when it comes to forks. This is the side that says compression. And we know that that is the lockout. <laughs> this, is, this is your compression, and I'm doing this with my fingers. Can you believe that? piece of shit fork they sold us. Unbelievable. So how much compression does that give us? I squeeze it down and I'm at three inches. So I get an inch and a half of suspension you can compress with your finger. That's locked out. But it's still, I have no idea what it's doing in here. Look at that now. Doing this with my fingers, y'all. All right, let's get inside the fork more if we can. So there's a one little BB and a spring. Springs on both of them. But only one had a BB. And then let's see if this will unscrew. You look like it's on to something came loose. Oh my God. Look what you got. This is your shock absorber. Can you see this? This is similar to uh, oh, do I got one of these here? Oh, I threw them away. This is similar to like the little dampers that you've got uh, closing your windows. What a jip! What a ripoff! All right, so there's an all threaded coupling. That is your shock absorber. <laughs> is that not funny? That's pathetic. And it's not even consistent. 
No idea how you lock that out. And then there's nothing left inside here. That's just a hollow, heavy metal tube. Unlike the new forks, which are aluminum. These here, nothing in there to see. There's nothing to do. That's some type of an alloy. But I want to get deeper into this thing here. So how do I do that? I don't know what it's going to take to get in there, but I can tell there's spring in there and that's all of your suspension. So right here, I'm using the palm of my hand, no tools. You can see I'm able to get some compression there. Now, let me put some tools on here. That's not doing me any good. That is your suspension. You got an inch of available suspension on that piece of shit stock juiced bike spring. And it's not comfortable. Now that's what you're getting when you're pressing down on your forks, you know, from a seating position. And that's all you get going down the road. That, and where is that piece of shit? <laughs> this, that I'm pushing in with my hands. That is your suspension. Oh my God, did we get ripped off or what? Are you seeing this? That's your suspension. Legally, Toga can call it a full suspension. But I wouldn't put that kind of suspension on a two-year-old's tricycle. Horrible. And all of you people, <laughs> all them faggots in California on the Facebook forum saying, there's nothing wrong with those forks. Those forks are perfectly fine. I like them. I love my forks. Look at that. I give up. What a piece of shit. Let me know what you think. <laughs> Forward this around. I'll see you. I'm out of here.